What's up, everybody? Tyson Roush. Let's talk Jets. Hope everybody's doing excellent as we all sit and wait for this Aaron Rodgers trade to finally get done. I'm guessing it gets done over the next week as the owners' meetings are going on, and I think cooler heads will prevail, and they finally say, you know what, we both need to move on and get this, get this over with. But uh, Elijah Moore trade to the Cleveland Browns, quite interesting on so many different levels. You look at the compensation, the Jets get pick 42, the Browns get Elijah Moore, I think it's pick 74. And I guess if you want to see who won the trade, I guess it's kind of what you think it's your, your value of Elijah Moore is. To be honest, I was very interested to see him in, in the Hackett offense with Aaron Rodgers throwing the ball. Get him in space, let him run, let him flourish. You have Wilson and Lazard. Moore can get a lot of opportunities. But then also you kind of think, last year, did he quiet down and, and the Jets make him a promise? Listen, man, be a good teammate the rest of the year and we'll trade you after the season was over. And this is the best offer they could get. You don't really know how that works. Um, but again, he's moving on, and, and now you say, okay, what do you do with the slot position? You have Garrett Wilson, you have Lazard. They signed Nicole Hardman from the Chiefs. Very fast, dude. Super, he has game-changing speed. Great returner. So he's basically a replacement of Barrios. You can use him on jet sweeps. You can do all those different things. And then you say, you know what? Do the Jets have a deal in place for you know Odell Beckham Jr., which could be possible. But also kind of, he could probably see this and be like, you know what? You got rid of Elijah Moore. My price tag's going up. But you got to kind of figure something else is in the way is going to happen here. And also, you got to figure if Corey Davis is a part of the Packers trade, maybe Randall Cobb is still going to be an option here as well. So there's a lot of moving parts with this. You look at the trade compensation, the value, the player, everything else, and it's interesting, man. It's very, very interesting. The wide receiver group is definitely going to be overhaul for Aaron Rodgers. And uh, I can't wait to see what happens. So I rushed through this a little bit because I'm going to teach in like 10 minutes, but I wanted to get something out there. Let me know your thoughts on this trade. Let me let me know your thoughts on what you think the Jets are going to do after this, and I'll talk to you later.